YouTube, this your boy Ghost Fighter 2 T's back with another video. Um, I try to inform you guys on any information that I get, whether it's car talk, game talk, uh, just things going on in the world. So today I have this awesome new product. It is by Armor All. It's, it's called Extreme Shield. Um, yeah, and I'm gonna tell you what all it has. It says ceramic. It says it is ceramic glass treatment and cleaner and it lays basic on the layer it says water repellent technology and it comes in this awesome orange looking and blue can this is can this is what's going to put on the market what's supposed to be killing rain x right now in competition with rain x this stuff is supposed to be better than rain x you're supposed to be able to spray it on my car is super dingy so we're going to get out and do this together um my car is super dingy it was in the shop i was getting some stuff some work done to it so, you know, let's let's hear my baby. Ooh. Oh yeah, she ready to go. So I was getting some work done to it. So um let's see if we can figure out what the directions are. I'm inside the car wash, so it's kind of dark. Um so it says shake well uh before use, use on a cool dry surface. Whole can four to six inches away from the lightly, evenly coated exterior glass surface. Use a microfiber towel and firmly buff the formulation off. Okay, so I seen a, a video about this and the guy didn't do the spray on and then wipe off. He actually just sprayed the window, gave the the formulation time to sit in the window and, and uh, seep into the window and then he sprayed it off with a pressure washer so that's what we're going to do here at the car wash today okay we're going to give this a try all right i'll be back when i have this right before i spray this on the window on the outside of the car and right before i turn on the car wash to wash the window off and we're going to see the results together okay all right here we go all right guys so this is the next part of the video we're gonna spray it on and all i gotta do is put in one more uh can or uh, one more quarter in the machine and we're gonna see what it does so we're gonna spray it on we're gonna do this side spray it on real good you want to get a nice little coat so i've never used this before it's my first time using it so i'm not a professional or anything I even do this part right here, and I'll do even half of this side of the window. Because my car is dingy. All right, so you see it got a nice little soap. All right, so let's see what this turns out to do. Let's see. All right, I'm gonna put my last quarter in. We're gonna see what happens. I do a rinse. All right. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Let's see what it does. See what it does. Um, to me, it doesn't seem like it beads up like the one video I seen. You can see the window is supposed to be window repellent. I think that it will probably work a lot better when I do the other side of the car if I wipe it down myself and then spray it. So we're going to see what happens when I do that. All right, be back. All right, what's good, Ghost King? So I saw that it did actually work better once I cleaned and wiped the window down. Once I cleaned and wiped the window down, uh, I'm kind of have mixed emotions about this. Uh, I'm hearing good things about it, but it seems like it being a glass treatment and cleaner, I don't feel like it's really a cleaner 
it's more so like a protective coat that you put on after you clean your windows with some good Windex. This is just my opinion, my view on it. It doesn't seem like it worked too good when you just spray it right on a dirty window. For sure, it doesn't work. And it seems like it. It seems like it's something that you tidy up windows with, so that when it does rain or it gets dust, it'll repel it. So uh, my final verdict, uh, I would say it's probably a six out of ten product. Um, for you, it may be better. Um, but far as what I can see and what I've got out of it, I've, I'm giving it a six out of a ten because it's just I don't know. It's it's not what I thought it was gonna be, and I paid roughly around seven to nine dollars for it. So I feel like just a good coat of wax, maybe. I mean, a good coat of a. Uh, of Windex, streak free Windex may work better than this stuff, man. So I don't know. Um, it is a new product. Um, I'm not saying it doesn't work and I'm not saying that it's not better than Windex. I think what I'm trying to say is, I, I think before you spend $10 on one of these, you definitely should try Windex first. And if it seems like the Windex is not working, then maybe you could try this ceramic glass treatment but it's definitely not what they put ceramic coating on a car it's definitely not that stuff but whatever's in it has some kind of uh repellent for water repellent so my windows are really dirty and i saw that it didn't super clean my windows like i would like so my final verdict for it is uh is yeah a six out of ten you guys can get your own um formulate your own opinion out of maybe giving this a try trying it out and uh letting me know what you think uh when you do your car window uh my advice to you would be for you to clean the window very thoroughly before putting this stuff on because like i said this is it's, it says that it's a, a a ceramic plus ceramic coating and it gives extreme shine um treatment and it says cleaner so I didn't really notice that when I did it. I feel like Windex would probably work better, but this is my opinion. I'm formulating my opinion around what I tried and what I did. If you guys got any suggestions or what you think I should maybe try and do, you guys let me know down in the comment section. I just try to put these videos together to kind of help you guys because who else is talking about it? So it might as well be me. Um, I appreciate you guys when you come through and watch my videos and listen. Um, that you're even willing to listen to me, man. We're on the way to 3,000 subscribers. You guys, make sure y'all hit me with a sub, like, and a comment, man, right down here. As always, this your boy, Ghostwriter 2 T's. I love you guys. Hey, if you got aspiration and dreams and things that you want to do, go for it. Whatever it is that you might see on YouTube, you see somebody else doing, you can do the same thing. You could do it as well as they doing it, but you got to be on your grind and you got to be focused in and once you do those things, you can do it as well, okay? Um, I love you guys. I don't want to um, steer you guys to do anything that I wouldn't do for myself. So, you know, with that said, I don't want to be the type of person to bring you guys videos just to get a view. I want to make sure that I'm giving you product, information, whatever it is that I'm doing. I want to make sure that you guys are getting the best quality of information possible to my knowledge, okay? Okay. All right, I love you guys. God bless y'all. This goes out to T's, and I'm out. Make sure you hit that sub, like, and comment. Peace.